Okay, I want to make a quick video. I'm going to make some other videos later. Sorry about the crappy quality. Later on, I'll learn how to do a screenshot. Um, but for now, a few people um, have asked me how to do an adjustment uh, for GameCube to be able to get your uh, remotes to work, your uh, Xbox controllers. Now, for the rest of you guys, I've already uh, got this set, but I did not set the third, fourth, and fifth player, I mean third, fourth, second, third, and fourth player controllers. So it's really easy. So let me show you guys how to do it. So real quick, you're gonna click on, go to your arcade drive, click on arcade. You're gonna scroll down till you see emulators. And we're looking for Dolphin. Okay. Now, there's a few different emulators that use Dolphin, but the one for GameCube is 5.0. Click on 5.0. Click on Dolphin. Now, this is the program, um, i.e. the emulator, for GameCube. Now, when you're setting up your other controls, this will be done the exact same way for any other emulator. Figure out which emulator that, that your system is running, and you can just log into the emulator itself and get into your controls. Now, to set the Wii controllers up, I mean, to set the uh, Xbox controllers up, we're going to click on controller. Click on standard controller. All right, now, first, you're going to see something like, something like this. Okay. I mean, that little spot there is right in the way. All right, so you're going to see something like this. You need to... All right, so what you do is you're going to click on Gamepad. And then we're just going to start loading. So mine are already set, but I'll do a few. You just click on A. It says waiting. The next button you touch will become that assignment. So I'm going to click A on my controller here. All right, go down to B, click B, click B on my controller. Which one's B? All right, and you just go all the way down. You click on this, click on the button that you want to assign, and then click on your controller. It's that easy. All right, now your control stick is your main stick right here. Your C stick is this stick and then your triggers you go ahead and set your triggers when you want to set your rumble pack just click on rumble you're gonna click on left click on select all right click on right click on select and then you can always test it out right now it's rumbling okay so when that's done you hit apply I'm not going to do that because mine have already been done. Now, here's where people mess up. You need to save the profile. It doesn't matter what you save it under, but it needs to be saved as something. So click player P1, P2, P3. So after you put P1 here, you'll just hit save, and then you're going to see it disappear. But, it's, but it'll be logged in here, and it'll be saved. Okay? So real quick, I'll go ahead and show you how. The only one I have not set up so far is... Uh, controller 4. Click on configure. Now what's really cool is you don't have to go in and click everything twice. So I'm going to click on uh, what I've got here which is X input 0 gamepad. Go over here to profiles. I'm just going to load up one of the other profiles. When I hit load. Bam! All my settings that I did for the last one are there. Okay, But for this one I need to change this. So it doesn't matter what you put it at. I'm just clicking a button on my uh, on my control panel here. I'm just using player two and any one of these buttons. They're all set for letters as key codes. A, B, X, Z, stuff like that. Only because I didn't feel like plugging in my Xbox, I mean my uh, keyboard. Okay, so now... I use one of the other ones to load. Now I save. Now watch when I save, it disappears. Bam. It disappears, but that doesn't mean it goes... It disappears completely. It just loads it in here. So now everything's done. 
so these are all set. And that is how you set your Wii controllers, I mean your uh, Xbox controllers, for Dolphin. I'm going to hit pause real quick and show you that it's working. I won't play this whole deal, but I'll show you. Get into hyperspin real fast. I'm going to pause this while it's loading. loading game. Okay. So you can play four players. I've only got one control set up. This is uh, Mario Kart Double Dash. So I'm gonna I'm gonna make another video later with YouTube. So I'll show you guys how to do a lot more settings. But this is how you do a setting for Nintendo GameCube running Dolphin. Almost every other deal will automatically recognize your Xbox controller. Okay. All right, guys. Call me if you had any questions.